That's right, that's right. Little bonus video today, publishing two videos today. Why? Because, well, I ran twice today and my legs are tired. And as runners, we need to get better at recovery, right? Taking care of our muscles, taking care of our, our ligaments, our tendons, our bones, everything. Oh, I need to do much better at stretching. All right, so I have right here three gift ideas for the runner in your life that maybe, maybe is struggling a little bit with recovery, needs to work on stretching, massaging, taking care of themselves so they don't get injured with plantar fasciitis. All right, so what do I have for you? I've got three gift ideas and yes, they're all down below. You can buy them down below. Here we go. The foot log right here. This is called the foot log developed, developed by a doctor. If you've been watching this channel for a long time, you know how much I love coffee. I might love the foot log just as much as coffee. Now that is saying a lot. I love this thing because it digs into my foot so well. The roller massage, love this thing. And then I don't love this thing because it brings on so much pain in my life. But basically this is a giant rubber band, also called the pro band. Basically it's for stretching. Sometimes, yes, I loathe stretching at times, and but I gotta, I gotta improve my stretching if I want to stay healthy moving into 2019. Like, it's critical. It's absolutely critical. What does the foot log actually do? It helps with reflexology, circulation, and finding trigger points on the bottom of your feet and the side of your feet. And yes, I've even used it on the top of my feet to a, to a certain extent. And it's all based upon these little knobs you can see here and they feel so good. In addition, the foot log can help improve circulation and that's really important for runners is circulation. Our blood, you know, goes from our heart down to our feet and that's a long ways. And so we need to be drawing blood down to our feet as much as possible to help with healing, to help with recovery, all of that stuff. And so by massaging your feet with this guy, so I, and I'm not the scientist, but basically it helps with the like the flexibility of your blood vessels, which again, not the doctor. So what you wanna do is you wanna roll your foot on this guy for five to eight minutes. Every time you use it, just sit down in a chair and just massage and it feels so good. So I highly, highly recommend this thing. It, this might help me overcome my plantar fasciitis. I'm, I'm not even kidding. And the second item, and again, it's available down below, the roller massage. Now, I love the foot log the most for recovery. But this guy is a really, 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 really close second. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is not plastic. This is a very dense foam. So it basically allows you to dig just a little deeper in into that deep tissue. Oh my goodness. I use this especially on my soleus. Uh, and see these ridges here? These ridges allow you to really find those sweet spots that are extra sore. I wish I would have had this last year when I was battling shin splints. This would have helped so, so much. I am a fool for not having it last year. So if you have shin splints or any sort of really nasty soreness in your calves and you can use it on your hamstrings and quads, I'd say it's maybe not quite as effective there. I definitely below the knee is where I, I like to use this the most. Amazing, I love it so, so much. Mwah. Oh, and one last thing, a couple of you have been commenting about IT band issues, money. This is your money shot. Oh man, just digging into that IT band area. Not too hard at first. Go gentle at first, but then slowly start working into it. Mm, this is your guy. This is your guy. The third and final item for the runner in your life, if you want to help them stay healthy moving forward, these two items are more about massage. This guy is about flexibility and stretching. And if you're a runner, a long distance runner, you know like flexibility is so important. With my plantar fasciitis, I am learning more and more that from my lower back to my buttocks, to my hamstrings, to my calves, to my soleus, to the bottom of my feet, it's all connected. And probably my PF flared up this year because I was not flexible. It's caused me so much pain over the last four months. And if I would have just stretched every single day for 10 minutes, just 10 minutes with this rubber band, I probably, I bet I would not have had the, the PF flare up. Therefore, I would, if you're going to buy any of these items, do this one. This one is going to keep you healthy long-term. 
These guys are more maintenance and working out those aches and pains. This guy is going to change your life, all right? You can use this to stretch your hamstrings, your groin, the bottom of your feet, your calves, everything with this guy. And basically, this replaces like a stretching partner. You know how sometimes you have somebody push your leg back for, to get your hamstrings really good? Well, we don't always have like somebody there to help us stretch. That's where this guy comes in. You can just pull that baby back and oh, feel the burn, baby burn. All right, those are my three ideas for you, to, for the runners out there and the runners in your life. Like if you wanna help them just a little bit and that does it folks, I am gonna say the keyword for this video is log, L-O-G, down below in the comments. Hit it up because I love this guy so much. It feels so good, especially after those long runs. This guy though is probably the most important tool in the toolbox for maintaining health as a long distance runner. No joke, no joke, no joke, no joke. And the question of the day on this bonus video, what is your go-to recovery tool? And maybe it's one of these three, maybe it's something else that I've never even heard of. Let us all know down in the comments. Let's learn together. And I think a lot of people will, will be interested to see what you're using because, oh my goodness, there's so many great things out there that I think a lot of people just have never heard of. Like this foot log, like this is new to my toolbox and I love it. I love it. All right, guys, that's it for today. And we will be back tomorrow.